Welcome back to The Simple Pair. In today's episode, we are going to be talking about the things that the other person does that annoys us, or in other words, our pet peeves about each other. We thought it'd be kind of fun to make a video and to have a good laugh. Yeah, and we also, we each made our own lists, but we didn't tell each other anything that's on our list. So everything that we're about to tell each other is a complete surprise. So with that being said, let's have Kaylin start with her All right. pet peeve of me. All right, my number one pet peeve about Dylan is that he doesn't wash his hands after he goes to the bathroom. <laughs> It's not always true. If I get on him about not doing it, I'll say, Dylan, go wash your hands. He'll just turn the water on and let it run a little bit and then turn it off. I <laughs> have one for Kaylin now that uh, she's not gonna expect. Okay, let's hear it. <laughs> Kaylin, she basically, she likes to freeze her bread. <laughs> <laughs> what? You like to freeze your bread. It's like it every time I try and make a toast, <laughs> I have to take it out and I have to break it apart with like a butter knife because it's rock solid. Number three, whatever, we're sitting at the kitchen table. We haven't said anything in about 30 seconds to each other. And I look at him and I say, what are you thinking about? And he goes, nothing. Guys, I don't, I don't believe it. I don't guys believe it. can think of nothing. I can just sit there and just be perfectly content and my brain waves are like nailed. I, One thing about Kaylin is um she vacuums like every single day <laughs> sometimes like three times a day it's like every couple hours <laughs> she's got something to vacuum so she's got something to vacuum up all the time <laughs> hey i just hear that a vacuum and i don't know why but that a vacuum just annoys me just like a whiny humming sound <clears throat> without fail every single time i cut up an apple dylan like comes up behind me he's like can i just steal one little piece and he grabs the biggest one usually, if not more. And so I never get my full serving of an apple and it's always less. In that. You guys know that little loop on the back of your jacket? Kaylin likes to take my jackets and hang them up by that little loop. And like, I go to take my jacket off and I nearly like, <laughs> like what the heck? What, did she super glue it to the, to the rack? Those are there for a purpose so that your jacket doesn't fall off the hanger. <laughs> it's the worst is when it's on a coat hanger and she like takes the time to like string the coat hanger through that loop Every and then she wraps the arms around and puts it in my closet and I'm like in a hurry I'm like oh we got to go to church I grab my jacket and it's like it, like rips the coat hanger off I'm still gonna keep doing it sorry one pet peeve I have about Dylan is that you let your glasses get incredibly dusty and dirty like he could go weeks without cleaning his glasses and when he's sitting in the perfect light i look at him and it's like i swear i don't know how you can do anything i don't know how you could do any like engineering calculations or how you even drive sometimes when we're out for like an evening stroll she walks like 2.5 times the speed that anyone else should walk she just like cruises <laughs> I'm like, Kaylin, I'm, I'm just trying to enjoy the this walk. I'm trying to enjoy this. And she's just like, booking it. <laughs> it's like, where you gotta be, hun? We're it's in the middle exercise. of nowhere. I see, he walks for leisure. I walk for physical activity. I walk to get my 30 minutes a day in because I know that that's what's important because I studied that in college. 30 minutes okay? a day. And we can't, we, we can't get done with the walk until that mm -hmm. 30 minutes has mm -hmm. transpired. Yep, you're right. You'll thank me later when you're 80 and limber. He doesn't trust me with a knife. I literally cut my finger one time, not even using a knife. I cut my finger on a piece of glass, which is a whole nother story. He like watches me like a hawk. And if I like happen to like miss slip with, a, with the knife, which is normal and everything's fine. Very he, normal. Like, he goes like, hun. She says she has never cut herself, but she has cut herself many times on the knife. She'll like sometimes put a band-aid on her finger and then she won't <laughs> tell me what it is. <laughs> and then she, I'll that be like- That one wasn't a knife, it was a cheese grater. <laughs> oh, okay. We'll plan to like go to bed at like, let's say 10 o'clock and <laughs> I'll brush my teeth and get ready and I'll be waiting. You know, we like to pray before we go to sleep. All of a sudden like five, 10, 15, 20 minutes have passed. And I'm like, honey, like, are you coming? And she's like, I just have to wash my face. 
And this little, this pet peeve happens every single night. And he can't really help it, but I think he could. He steals the covers every single <laughs> night. I wake up without a doubt, at least once in the middle of the night, frigid, just really cold. And I try to pull them over. And I swear Dylan has them like stapled to his side of the bed. <laughs> so I can't what, grab them. This is what she does. She's like, <laughs> cool. <laughs> But sometimes he also denies that he steals the covers. And so one time, I, in the middle of the night, when I, I got up to go to the bathroom and I came back and literally all the covers were on the ground on his side of the bed and then on top of him. So I went around and I got my phone and I took a picture of it to show him proof in the morning that he actually does steal my covers. So every time I get done with the shower, Kaylin makes me hang my towel up on a hanger. Oh, I have to stand there dripping wet like a dog. The people should know that we have a very small bathroom that can't fit our towels to dry. You know, I just want to like put it on a hook and just like... We don't have a hook. That's why you have to put it on a hanger. I like to put it on the doorknob. If he had it his way, he would either throw it on the ground and let it grow mold till the next time he needs to use it. No! And it wouldn't even be dry the next day you wanted that. to use it. Or he hangs it over the doorknob and it's really annoying because I get up in the night to go to the bathroom and like... This towel could be on the floor or could just get in my way You're and I can real, trip over this it. Is my, this is mine. This is mine, okay? No, I'm turning it into my pet peeve. No, it's my pet peeve. So, I, every time I try and take a shower, I have to go. She tells me I have to reuse a towel. That's fine. Well, duh. Who does the laundry every Sunday? I don't want to do any loads of towels. My, it's my, it's my pet peeve nighters. <laughs> Well, thanks for watching this video, guys. We hope that you enjoyed um, having a good laugh with us. Uh, and we do really, we love each other so much. But it's just fun to kind of talk about the things that we do that bother each other. So if you enjoyed watching this video, please like it and subscribe to our channel. Uh, and you can also like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. So see you next time. Bye, guys.